Hello YouTube, this is Dylan Senior 13 back with another video. Um, I'm making an electronic firework igniter. Uh, it, you press a button and it sets fireworks off. So um, I'll just show you around it first and then um, I'll show you how it works in a bit. So you yeah. basically you connect these to a car battery when I get some clips for the end. Clip it, it runs on a 12 volt system everything. It's not 100% finished yet but um, I'm working on it. That the screen's going to be there, telling the the voltage of the battery to check if it's dead or not. So um, the screw holes are there. You just put there's eight screws all around it, just for the top one. The bottom one's completely like sealed on. It won't come off. No screws holding it on though. It's glue, really strong glue. So basically, you just put the screws in there, and then the top won't come off. I won't need to keep opening it, um, but I'm just opening it for now to show you guys so um yeah i'll just show you inside it now um there's a few wires um there's going to be even more at the end because i need to put the screen in and everything it's uh, quite complicated i've done a lot of soldering on this um i've used a whole roll of solder and uh yeah so basically there's a main switch there which turns the whole system off um, they're just systems for the r main switches for the each row, so that'll be that switches for the top row to completely turn it off and on. Um, there's going to be a little LED light here on each row, so you can check if that row's on or off. Um, there's ten. You can, there's it's a ten Q. You can put ten different fireworks in at a time, and you can probably connect two to each one. Yeah, up here. I'll just put it back together for now. They're just there. There's things that are back of speakers. You're basically just going to plug because the firework things that are going to ignite it. I'll show you in a bit, but you it's going to obviously be on a longer wire, like maybe 20 meters. You plug it into the back of there, which all you'll have to do is plug it in the back of there, lead the wire to where the firework is, and so on with all the rest there. Um, and that one will be number one, and one there, number two is there. Then for the next row it starts somewhere around there, I think. Yeah, and so on there. So it's they're all gonna be numbered like one to ten on the numbers and the switches. Um so I'll show you inside now. Again. So you can see all the back of all the switches. That's basically inside. That's where the main two terminals come off um, I'll just take my phone off the tripod so this is inside I've just neaten the wires up a bit more so um, these two dangling off here these are just for the LEDs that are telling you as I said before the LEDs that are going next to the one and two of the main switches for each row that they'll go to there and I've put that block connector block there, so there's only two wires coming out of it now. But when I get the screen, which should just pop in there, that should, I'm just going to unscrew them, put put them two wires that will tell you how the voltage of the battery. Just post them in there. Um, yeah, I'll show you the buttons that are wired up. They're all the buttons. Uh, basically, I've put one which is the negative, which is going through all these jumping across for, from each terminal and then from the other side of the button I've put these that are coming off the other side of the button I don't know if you can quite see but basically there's two terminals I've put hot, I've put hot glue over the terminals just in case they touch or anything because we don't want any fireworks going off at random times so um, that's inside two main switches, these are for the LEDs as well that's it. this is negative for the LEDs this is positive, actually it's the other way around, this is negative, that's positive basically so when you flick that switch it's basically two coming out of there so um, then I'll show you the other side of it, there's a lot of wiring in here, it's the only way I could do it um, basically, I'm, I have, I've only just done them today, so I haven't hot glued them yet um, so it's just two in that end one, but basically there's one main one which it just jump keeps jumping across, and then these ones keep go they don't jump across they go straight into the one 
it's a complicated complicated and I've already checked it through my voltmeter on that setting that um, beeps when there's a complete circuit and it works so I'm quite pleased with it um, I'll just quickly show you how it'll ignite the fuse I've already checked it and tested it on a firework see if it'll work and it ignites it in about a second by holding the button just for a second and it sets it off it's straight away I didn't test it with this box I tested it by just putting electric through them two terminals there uh, straight onto a car battery touched it onto the terminals of the car battery and it ignited the firework it was only a little fountain but um, we should do it so with some big cakes now so basically it's just a coil at the end which uh, they clamp together with tin because and you can't do it with solder because it'll just melt the solder because it gets really hot really quick um, even just tapping it on it melts the solder off straight away you can see how burnt they are it's tin so it can't, it's got a high melting point to connect electric to them too obviously the wires are going to be longer and you'll attach like crocodile clips onto them lead the wire longer to attach it so um, basically they'll just go in there whichever one I've made 10 of them they're quite hard to make um, so you just literally clip them in like that but obviously it'll be a longer wire like an extension basically like it can be as long as you want you could be really far away from it you can be as far as you want as away from it if you want so that's the mechanism as how it will ignite the fuse so um yeah that's pretty much it for this video um as i says it's not finished yet so i'll be doing another video when it's finished and hopefully setting a few fireworks off so um Please like this video, um, share it and leave a like. Thanks.